Hi guys. So you wanted to know how to make the squishies. So I'm going to do a little tutorial for you now. Um, make sure you've got plastic cups. And the stuff I bought to make squishies is Polly Craft. Um, I got it off Amazon. So you get the um the a and the b together it's a little expensive but it works so make you sure you use some sort of wooden or plastic stirrer i suggest the end of a paintbrush or a lollipop stick that'd be the best bet so but One for your A and one for your B. I'm using a measuring cup, but um, I'm not gonna fill it the whole way. I'm gonna fill it halfway. So make sure you give it a good old shake. Also, if you're, if you need adult supervision for this, um, but I'm not, I haven't got any gloves on. You should rarely use gloves while you're doing this as well. So with your A in the first cup, add two. And with your B, once you've used it I'll point you down a little it's got um so you now will add your B to your other cup so you only want one B And then you want to add your B into your A. And start stirring straight away and make sure you stir it for a good 30 seconds. And then you get your silicone moulds and pour in. The scarred of the cups as soon as you've used them as well. And as you can see, they're starting to rise. Five minutes later. So after five minutes, they should be all ready. <laughs> So just pop them out. One. Two. That looks like, um, what's it called? It looks called three. I think my daughter wants to get involved. So hello. Mom. So they should, they might be a little bit sticky. sticky. Oh, dog hair. It's dog hair. Um, yeah, so leave them for a little bit extra to dry out a bit better so they're less sticky. And then you can start painting them. I got this from B&M. Walmart. Walmart, you might be able to get them from Walmart. Um, so, yeah. Let's you can paint pop these of them. open. You can paint. Ah. 
your fabric paint will come in a little bowl like this normally over here it does yeah you can get bigger ones all bigger ones but they still come in the bottles like that oh see she hadn't even brushed her hair today they're still too sticky Miley. unpack them and we'll be back in a tip five minutes later okay so if you haven't got paint brushes what i like to use is a kitchen scourer so i'm just going to chop it into three and this one as well so that you can put your paint on there and dab you don't have three do you, do, you, do you want to paint, Miley? <laughs> I'm going to use... I'm using these. This yellow. I'm going to so mix it. I'm going to squeeze some of this yellow on. How, how are we going to mix it then, Miley? Go and find something to mix it with. <laughs> can't really see but it's kind of going yellow. It does take a while for them to dry if you really like put a lot on. So I'm gonna add some more. I'd say give it about three hours to dry. So you can do your top part first let that dry and then you can do your bottom part then that that dry and then it will be done you can kind of see true that as we're from the UK, we like a cup of tea. <laughs> in my, I'm not drinking in tea. my B and M mug. Sprinkles. Sprinkles. Blankles. Leave it to dry for a good two, three hours, and then you paint the other side. And that is it. Um, so yeah, that's my squishy video <gasps> all done with the interruption of Miley. Um, I interrupt people. You wouldn't want me in your video. <laughs> Yeah, so you wanted the squishy tutorial video. I hope I did it justice. Make sure you have adult supervision while doing it because of the chemicals you'll be using. Um, shop on Amazon for the polycraft. Make sure you use your plastic cups and your um, plastic stirrers and discard of them when you're done. Um, yeah that's it thank you for watching like the video and subscribe to my channel laters <laughs>